renowned violinist Mira Wang has made a name for herself on global stages, performing with the world's greatest orchestras. Now she's teaming up with Bill Murray for his classical musical, New Worlds. What sparked your interest in violin? You know, I was a young child. I grew up in China. And uh, back then, I think mostly my parents said, we would like you to learn violin playing. And I was sent to somebody who was a musician, a violin teacher. And she actually now lives in the States. And uh, just to see if I had any talent, and she said she should definitely learn music. I studied at Boston University and uh, I was there for about six years. I did the undergraduate and graduate school. And so after that, I wanted to become a so-called a soloist and wanted to travel to perform. And that's how I came to New York. New Worlds aims to explore themes of American identity. How do you relate to this as an artist? Going abroad is to be open to learn a different culture. And I think I'm one of those, I did come to the States but I was open to the new culture. I was ready to learn a new language and to absorb what is the new country offering me. It took some courage. I used to read you know, English books and I had to struggle. And that's how you begin to really integrate into a new culture. And I think it's important when you choose to live in a foreign country, you have to learn their language and you have to learn their culture in order to really know what the country is about. So of course, these are the best American literature we are dealing with, and this is definitely worth learning. What's been your favorite part about the New Worlds collaboration? I think for me, the most moving part of, in the whole program is the Huckleberry Finn, the adventure of the Huckleberry Finn, and how Bill Murray reads the whole story, this one story. It's unbelievably moving. Experience of being on the stage, it's that how we transport our experiences, our enthusiasm to the audience. And that I think if you're enthusiastic about what you're doing, people will feel that, uh, although they're not on stage with us, but they can be part of us. How has your Chinese heritage influenced your music today? The culture itself, it helps a great deal because China has uh, 5,000 years of culture. And I think uh, sometimes what we, how we grow up and we don't realize how much of the culture we already carry in ourselves. And then of course you come to abroad and uh, I was lucky to have met incredible pe uh, many people, including my violin teacher. All of them gave me in unbelievable influence. And so I think then you can take um, different cultures and take the best of them and to express uh, what you need to. We made you in your innocence sail through this to that. 